Jerry was beloved by so many people, you know, uh, you know, in and around San Diego, in the military, uh, in New York, you name it. You know, he, he crossed so many bridges in life that, and interacted with so many people that, uh, you know, again, uh, you know, his presence uh, amongst others, uh, they're better off for it. If you have a son or daughter, you want him to grow up to be Jerry Coleman because he was approachable, he was honest, he had a joy for life, and uh, uh, that he, every time I met him, uh, it, it was just another fun experience. So, an incredible human to be. Jerry treated people so well, and I think that's what many of us here will miss about him the, mo the most. He was the best man that I've ever known. I mean, in terms of character, integrity, honesty, his ego was removed at birth. He had none. He was indestructible. He was made of the same material as the statue out here at the ballpark. And we thought he would live forever and bury us all and mourn us. And I never thought we would mourn him. Uh, you know, there wasn't a guy that, that, that didn't pass Jerry, that, you know, didn't, you know, say hello to Colonel. And, uh, and he didn't answer back. And whoever that person was, you know, his... Uh, you know, his time just sitting in the chair uh, next to my desk and us talking about life. Uh, that's what I'll remember. Wynn waiting to pitch. There's a drive, right center field, base hit, and there it is! Ho-ho, doctor! You can hang a star on that, baby!